Today's educational game that I play is a fun chemistry puzzle about the vitamin types. But first, what is a vitamin? This is an organic molecule that every organism metabolism needs to function correctly. But it needs it in small quantities. But it is essential to have, to have it. So, here at the bottom are the types, the types of vitamins and we have a picture, a fruit or vegetable that contains that vitamin. In general, all vegetables and fruits have vitamins and this is for a little fun where we know one food with the type of vitamin. Okay, I will begin with vitamin B12 which is named also cobalamin. And now this is the first clue that uh, I have. This is, I am searching for a formula that has cobalt. And this is it, the biggest one. Now the B12 is contained in fish, also in other things. But if you eat fish, you can have vitamin B12. Uh, let's see at the chemical formula. This is 63 atoms of carbon, 88 atoms of hydrogen, 1 atom of cobalt, 14 atoms of nitrogen, 14 atoms of oxygen, and I think this is 1 atom of phosphorus. This is very different for the main vitamin formulas. And this is the vitamin B12. Now I will sort the rest of the easiest one. I'm still learning to watch the camera from the right because winter is coming and the weather is too dark to record from the left side. Uh, let me find vitamin Vitamin mm. A. This is retinol. It is contained in carrots. So, if we eat carrots, there is vitamin A. Also, this retinol name reminds me for UFO Afterlight. This is a game by Altair. And it is an amazing game, video game to play. <laughs> Okay, the next, uh, first, let's see the vitamin A. It has uh, 20 atoms of carbon, 30 atoms of hydrogen, and 1 atom of oxygen. For a difference, let's play vitamin C, which can, is contained in lemons. It has 6 atoms of carbon, 8 atoms of hydrogen, 1 and 6 atoms of oxygen. <laughs> Now it's time to apologize if I make mistakes, but this is uh, another interesting thing in my videos, that if you find mistakes, that means you have watched the video. <laughs> and I'm almost always eager to correct my mistakes. I'm not eager to not make mistakes, but to correct them. This is the philosophy of these lands. Okay, I got vitamin vitamin B3. This is niacin is pronounced. And this is, I think, here, which is uh, six atoms of carbon, five atoms of hydrogen, one atom of nitrogen. Ah, here is an interesting thing. Oh, okay. I can see now that all B vitamins has nitrogen. Here, this is uh, B2. Okay, oh, this is B2. Riboflavin, riboflavin. B3, this should be B7, that has nitrogen. And this is C, E, and D. They, they don't have nitrogen and A. 
I learned something new today. So this concept is working. <laughs> ah. Okay. Uh, vitamin B7. That is the biotin contained in uh, peanuts. Uh, oh no, no, it's not peanuts. Okay, I don't know everything yet, but okay, this is ten atoms of uh, carbon, sixteen atoms of hydrogen, two atoms of nitrogen, three atoms of oxygen, and we have one so. Sodium? Nope, this is sulfur. So, this is something interesting about B7. It has sulfur in its chemical formula. Uh, this is in general, of course, uh, like let's say this is uh, vitamin D, which is ergo calciferol, but it is, I think, the second of three forms of vitamin D with 28 atoms of carbon, 44 atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen. This is vitamin D. Uh, here is the vitamin B1. Thiamine. Thiamine. C12, H17 and O. O S. So B1 and B7 has S. <coughs> hmm. Interesting. But I have to conclude this with vitamin E. This is alpha tecopherol contained in nuts. Here's the formula and I got it for 8 tries, almost for pure A. <coughs> 